Hi, I'm Jamie from Company Folders. This tutorial will show you how to customize and work with the folder design templates that you can download for free from companyfolders.com. First off, I'm going to show you how to add a new font to one of Company Folders design templates. You can find fonts all over the place online, and many of them are even available for free. All you need to do to make a font available in Adobe Photoshop, Illustrator, or InDesign is download it and install it to your computer. I've gone ahead and downloaded this font. If you're using Windows 7 or 8, all you need to do is navigate to where the font is located, in this case the Downloads folder, right-click it, and then select Install. If you're using Mac OS X, then drag the file itself into your computer's Fonts folder inside your library. If you're logged in as an administrator, then this folder is located under your computer's basic volume, library, and then fonts. If you're logged in as a user, the fonts folder is in the base volume under users, your username, library, and fonts. Once your font file is in this folder, the font has been installed. And as you can see, when we open up Photoshop, we now have access to it, and we can apply it to our folder design template. Here I'm going to show you how to edit the default text in a company folders design template. So this is really simple. All you need to do is grab the program's text tool, then select the text you want to edit, and make whatever changes you like. You can use different words, and you can also change the font, size, color, or style. If you don't want the text in your design at all, then you can also delete the text layer by right-clicking it and selecting Delete Layer. Let's go over how to replace the default images in one of Company Folder's design templates with your own custom images. Remember that the image you insert should be of similar proportions to the default template image that you're replacing. Otherwise, it might end up looking stretched out and distorted. The method you use to replace images will depend on which program you're using. If you're working with a template for Illustrator or InDesign, then all of the images in the template will be embedded links. To replace these images, we open up the Links window, select the image you want to replace, and then click the Relink button. Then we just select the file for the image we want to insert. If you're working with a Photoshop template, then you can replace an image by finding its Smart Object Layer in the Layers window. Then right-click it, click Replace Contents, and select the image you want to insert in its place. This tutorial will show you how to replace the placeholder logo in a company folder's design template with your own logo. Before you do this, make sure that you have your logo artwork. And if it's a raster image, it should be over 300 dpi at 100% size to ensure the best results. The logos in our templates aren't smart objects, so to replace them, we'll need to delete them and then add our own artwork manually. If you're working in Illustrator, then select the placeholder company folders logo and then use the delete key or the backspace key to remove the logo. Then we just click file and place and select our logo file to add it to the template. If you're working in Photoshop, then select the layer with the placeholder logo in the Layers window, and Delete. Then select File and Place to insert your own logo. We've gone over a few ways that you can edit a folder design template. But let's say that instead, you want to extract part of the template to use in a completely different design. Let me show you how to transfer an image from a company folder's design template to a new design. This is very simple to do. All you have to do is copy the element that you want from the template, and then paste it into your own design. Okay. 
You can also drag and drop elements from one window to another. Alternatively, you can delete every layer except for the ones containing the elements that you want to keep. And then just save as under a different file name. When you're working with company folders design templates, you might notice that some of them have unique effects applied to the images. For example, this template has a photo of a ship that's been divided up into these square shapes with rounded corners. This type of effect is done through the use of smart objects, and it's possible to not only apply the same effect to a different photo, but to use that photo in a totally different design. This effect is created by a combination of layers that are all contained within this folder labeled 1. All we have to do is click and drag the folder into a different project. We can then just right-click the layer containing the image we want to change, click Replace Contents, and then select a different image file. Thanks for watching this tutorial. To download free folder design templates from Company Folders, just visit www.companyfolders.com/fdt.